Hello and welcome back to my channel. I am Angela. I am a full-time voiceover artist and audiobook narrator, and my channel is dedicated to those of you who are just starting out in this wonderful world of voiceover so I can help you along your own journey with technical aspects and, you know, what voiceover is, where to find work, and all that other fun stuff. So thank you so much for joining me today. And we just had Mother's Day, which was just a couple days ago. So happy belated Mother's Day to all of you out there who are not only mothers, but parents trying to somehow manage to juggle, you know, maybe a full-time job and then voiceover or some other freelance career side hustle on the side and family chores, bills, housework, yard, everything else that you need to do in a day. And that brings me to something that I was thinking about just today with Mother's Day uh, just a couple of days ago. I was very thankful to be able to be home to spend more time with my son because that was my why. That was why I wanted to start this career and this business because I wanted to spend more time with my family, namely my son, because they grow so fast. You know, I wanted to spend as much time with him as I possibly could to help him with school and just to spend more time with him watching movies. And because when I had a full time nine to five, I was there a long time during the day, you know, from, you know, six thirty seven o'clock till five or six o'clock in the afternoon. And then I would come home pretty much go right to the studio for a couple hours, come out, make dinner and then put the kiddo to bed and then right back into the studio for a few more hours. And that is a lot. That is a lot to put on your plate, and you're sacrificing the time with your family. And my son wasn't really at the age where he understood my why didn't make sense to him because I was doing this for him, yet I saw him less than I did than, I, than before I even started the voiceover as a side hustle. So now that I'm full time and have been for about 14 months or so, I get to finally show him the fruits of my labor and my why fully formed into reality. So what I wanted to discuss today is what is your why? What is your why to make this work for you. Whatever it is, whether it's voiceover or some other type of freelance side hustle, your why has to be the one thing that you hang on to with both hands. It has to be the reason that you spend all the time that you do on your side hustle. Your why is what gets you there. Your why has to be fully formed and solidified, written down in front of your face. It has to be your goal. It has to be that thing, that reward at the end of your struggle to get there. Your why is the most important thing to making this work. So what is your why? Is your why spending more time at home with your family? Is your why to make more money and maybe to move into a bigger house or a different city or a different country even? Is your why the ability to just fire your boss and be your own boss? What is your why? Whatever your why is, write it down. Write it down on a piece of paper and put it in front of your face. Put it on your computer monitor. Put it on your visor of your car and have it down in front of your, I mean, don't crash, but have it in front of you. Put it on your bathroom mirror. Have several of these around the house to keep you motivated. Because when you find those times where it's just too hard, it's hard on you mentally, physically, emotionally, in any which way, whatever point that you get to, and you start to question, why am I doing this? There's your why right in front of you. Just a quick reminder to remind you that this is your goal. This is your purpose. 
Just take a moment and visualize in your head what it would be like as if you had already attained your why. If you can visualize this end goal, your why, that will help you subconsciously to get there. If you just take that break from that frustrating moment that you're having and visualize attaining that why, that what, that where, whatever it is, is your reason for doing what you do. Visualize it as if you already have it. And that will help you strengthen your purpose and your goal to get there. Now, I know it's hard. I know it's hard. Work-life balance when you're trying to start a new voiceover career, a new freelance side hustle of some sort, whether it's an Etsy shop or whether it's a, you know, a website marketing or digital marketing or photography, whatever it is, especially when you already have a full-time job, that's a lot on your plate. And I completely get it. I was there. I did it. I did it for two years. The balance between work and life, everyday life, the balance between sleep and getting the job done, building a business is not easy. Finding that balance between your side hustle, full-time job, and your family is not easy. There's going to be a lot of grade lines. It does help if you have a planner. I have found this tremendously helpful for myself and my own business is to have a daily planner and to schedule things in so you, A, don't forget things because I tend to do that too, and B, so that you can see at a glance your time blocks. So if you have from this point to this point your daily nine to five job, And then from this point to this point is what you're going to allow yourself that day for your side hustle. And then you know you have this point to this point for your family at the end of the day. And if you wanted to, you can even add another this point to this point after that to get back to your side hustle. It's not easy at all. But I promise you, if your why is strong enough and you're passionate about passionate enough about what it is that you want to do to achieve your why, then you will get there. It just takes persistence and dedication, a little bit of sacrifice, and some sleepless nights. But in the end, when you attain that why, that what, that where, it'll be all worth it. Every struggle, every, every night where you're about to just pull your hair out, every night where your children are maybe crying that you aren't there to read them a bedtime story and your other partner has to read it for you. Whatever the struggle is, believe me, I understand. And you can get through it. You can get to your why, your where, your what. But you have to keep with it. You have to keep a reminder in front of you. Like I said, write it down. Keep it on your computer monitor. Keep it on your bathroom mirror. Keep it in front of your face. Make it your screensaver on your phone. Whatever it is, remind yourself of why you are doing what you're doing. And visualize yourself at that place of already achieving it. And that will help you get through those tough, difficult days and nights. And believe me, I am not here on my high horse, giving you pie in the sky. I am giving you reality. I've done it. I know a lot of other people that have done it. So I encourage you to do the same. And sometimes it may take a little bit longer. It took me about two years a year and a half to two years to get this done. It may take a little less time for some. It, take, it might take a little bit more time for some. But if your why is strong enough and your passion for what you're doing is strong enough, you will make it happen. 
So I encourage you to go get it. Go get it. You deserve it. Go get it. Don't wait. Stop watching this video and go get it. <laughs> Thank you so much for your time. I'm... I'm going to stop ranting now and just say thank you for watching this video. For all of you that have watched my videos and left a like or hit the subscribe button, thank you. Thank you so much. I am just honored and humbled by some of your comments and some of your emails and the people that reach out to me from watching my videos here. I am in no way any kind of like uber professional, you know, I, I am just like you. I had a passion and a dream and a why, and I went after it, and I achieved it. So I am living proof that you can do this, and I wanted to share what I have learned with you in the hopes of saving you time, heartache, trouble, frustration, because I want to help you get there. I want to help you achieve that why, what, where. So I hope that you do. So thank you again. If you have any comments, questions, anything at all, please leave them down below or send me an email. I always love hearing from you guys. If you'd like to know more about me, my work, or how I can help you get started in voiceover, come on over to my website at voiceoverangela.com. But if you found this video helpful, please hit that like button and subscribe because why not? Thank you so much and have a great day. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.